Let's see how ketchup is made. I never sold out to ketchup. I've only sold out to the mustard company, which is also Heinz, I believe. Tomato ketchup. We have it with burgers, fries. There's too much. He's putting too much on. What is this? A ketchup only burger? I can't watch this. I should be playing pilot wings. We make about 1.8 million bottles a day, and that relates what? to about 175,000 tons of ketchup a year. They're making 1.8 million ketchups a day. That's too much ketchup on there. It's just ketchup. You don't even use it that much, do you? Go to the paste dumper. Where these huge Ronin pings oh, that's the, the dumper. Package. <laughs> How were four clips made? The fuck is this? What did he call this? The paste dumper? What the hell just happened? This is what you guys are eating out here. Every time you guys put on a, the whole bottle of ketchup, like at the start of the video, somewhere there's one burger under that. After the paste has been extracted, he got a hose down. This says the ketchup hoser. He's got a hose that ketchup now. This makes it easier to transport to the storage tank where it will sit until pasta, too. This is for making pasta. This is such a sham corporation. All their all their equipment is to make pasta. It will sit until moving. It says pasta, too. To What's in there? Old ketchup, old ketchup from last week. Ketchup is made of five ingredients sugar, vinegar. Tomato paste, brine, and the secret spices. Does anybody know what the what the secret spices are? Only cinnamon. It's just pure cinnamon. <laughs> they just dump a shit ton of cinnamon into ketchup. Cheeto dust. I'm gonna try and piece together the secret spices. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say it's this. I'm gonna say salt, turmeric, sand. Cinnamon and a little pinch of the Kraft macaroni and cheese cheese powder. This is our quantifier. It's a method where we measure viscosity of our Heinz tomato ketchup. What we do is we put a certain amount of ketchup inside the quantifier, we release it, and we measure how fast it has traveled after 10 seconds. 10.5 within range. <laughs> it's a special method designed by Heinz. The ketchup cannot move faster than 0.028 miles per hour. No way are they testing it. Like, how many ketchups did they make before they did that test? It looked like they made like a trillion. And then they do a one test and they go, oh, throw it in the trash, make some more. The ketchup was too fast. Dump it. I could screw all those on faster than the robot. You only need two people to make ketchup. You only need the ketchup hoser and the, and the ketchup uh, sp speed tester and what if they do a robot that can test it then we'll be out of we'll be out of business they won't need us anymore this is the old robots back in the day they used to look like people but this is how to make pencils where's the jake paul poster i still got it one second i'll get it i got it back Racer into the ferrule's other end and squeezes that tight. Meatballs for all. The pencils are finally ready to roll across the grinding drum for sharpening. So that's how pencils is made. Now you guys gotta see this, how they make gum. You're never gonna be able to have gum again. Modern chewing gum was patented in the U.S. in 1869 by, believe it or not, a dentist. A dentist? Talk about a bad dentist. What kind of a dentist comes up with that? They invented it just so they could be in business. Because nobody was going to the dentist, so they had to come out with all this invention. So people actually had to go. Bubble gum comes in gumballs of all colors and sizes. That is true, actually. Traditionally, the base came from tree resin. Today, it's synthetic, made of plastics and rubbers. Don't never eat gum, you guys. <laughs> never eat the gum. <laughs> it's made out of plastic. <laughs> Then add color and flavoring. That's Kool-Aid. Oh, that's blood, actually. So, so far, gum is plastic and goat's blood. The stirring action builds up heat, which... I think that's melted human flesh. This is the uh, pilot wing soundtrack, by the way. Somebody go and chomp on that. <laughs> what if somebody falls in there? They'll be stuck in there for life. The machine cuts it into bite-sized pieces, pushes each piece into a wax paper wrapper, 
then twist both ends of the wrapper closed. They're putting this out of business, you guys. It's robots making everything, everything you guys like. Ketchup is robots. Gum is robots. Cereal is still people. Don't worry. I love to see a cereal robot. Wouldn't be possible. I guarantee you, you can't do cereal with robots. This is our one uh, zone where we can be in charge. The operator locks the lid, and the system pipes. See, you need the cereal operator. You can't do robots on this. Water and flavorings directly into the cooker. The mill has two big heavy rollers. The kernels fall between these rollers. The wheat flakes turn whiter, and the corn turn more yellow. See, you need to be human to pet the food. You need a cereal petter. At this point, the flakes are still quite soft and not at all tasty. Okay, actually, I think that was not actually a job. I don't think a guy actually picks it up for no reason. But there is still a that one guy. Remember that first guy? The drum revolves to gently toss the cereal. Oh no! Oh no! Look what they did. They t they eliminated the hoser job. It's just a robot hosing it down. How the fuck did they get a robot to be able to hose it down? Push rods guide the bags of cereal into the boxes. The best before date and other information have been printed on the outside. <laughs> Where's the box liquor? This is actually less people than the last thing. <laughs> it was just the one guy at the start. <laughs> That's all they needed. I thought cereal was too advanced, but that was actually the most automated one yet. Now, olive oil. They could never make olive oil. It's going to be like a ton of people have to go and pick all the olives off. That's why it's so expensive. What the Workers fuck is that shake thing? shake the olives off the branch with vibrating rakes. <laughs> Robot shakes all the olives off a tree. That's one human down. It's people doing it. The robot's really doing all the work. They're just holding the robot. So it's this is only counts as one person. <gasps> Who is that? Now is this a job? Because this could bump us up to two. They just p they picked it up and they dumped it back in. They literally did nothing. I I'm feeling like this is not a job. The stirrer. <laughs> the tester. <laughs> The tester is going to see how fast that olive oil goes. A sample of every batch goes to the testing room. <gasps> there's a man who has a nose for the job. Two. We're up to two people. There's a testing man. He smells it. The process is entirely automated. That's crazy. That was two people. Olive oil really was one of the hardest ones to make. Now if this was cereal, then you would only need one person. You gotta be careful when you do these bets, you guys. Because you never know what's gonna happen in a world like this. How are bananas made? That's a good question. Alright, how many bananas are in this video? Are you saying it's 1 to 40 bananas? Or even more than 40 bananas in the video? And right off the bat, we're seeing 1 here. Wow, a lot of people are saying more than 40. Okay, let's count. I see 34 here. Okay, 30... I think we're at 33? 34. I'm gonna count this as one big banana though. Oh, the fruit. This Heading little conveyor line. Plant. I'm gonna say there's two bananas on that thing. That brings us up to 32. 32 we're at. <laughs> oh, here come a couple more. 34. 34 bananas. Bananas is the most people of any food so far. Bananas is like the cheapest food. We're paying this robots more than we're paying the people that make these bananas. This is like three bananas in there. So that brings us up to 39. When the stores need them, these rooms will be flooded with ethylene gas. Oh, these are 3D. 3D? I said that counts as half a banana. 39.5. For this UK. one, I had to give it one more banana because there's definitely at least one there. All right. I guess that was probably more than 40. <laughs> Slightly more than 40. 